Hello, everyone. Welcome to the show. I'm Mike, and I'm Laura. Laura, you're not lip syncing today. Oh, oh, okay. Should I be lip syncing? Is that because you want to appear as talented as you are? I know. I'm just doing this live. Yeah, we were lip syncing <laughs> yesterday, but then we realized as we read the article、mm. that maybe if we do lip sync, cheating, even, even for fun. That's right. Some people might think of it as cheating、mm. because when singers, when performers, even famous people like Madonna or Beyonce or、yeah. Katy Perry, when they lip sync, some people might feel that they're trying to look more talented. They're trying to look like better singers、yeah. than they actually are, because of course the CD or the the recorded music、mm. sounds perfect. Maybe they wouldn't sound so perfect in real <gasps> life. Ooh, and especially when you've already paid so much money、right. for the concert tickets. Exactly. You kind of wonder, hey, what's going on? I mean, I could just go home. Sit in front of the computer, listen to lots of YouTube music videos. I don't have to pay so much money、yeah. just to watch you guys lip sync. That's right. But at the end of the article yesterday,、uh-huh. we learned that there actually might be some really good reasons、mm. the artists lip sync that have nothing to do with trying to、okay. cheat the audience or trying to look better than they、mm. than they actually are. So today we're going to be reading more about this、okay. controversial topic、I、of、see. lip syncing in pop music and find out a little bit why artists might. Do it for good reasons.、Hmm. Can we lip sync while we teach? No, but we can check out the article. Okay. Okay, let's do that.